video starts, I wanted to share with y'all and put y'all on to these glasses. I actually have terrible vision and if you've been following me for a long time, y'all know that your girl is blind as a bat. So getting new glasses is always exciting for me because if I don't have new selections, I literally do not get excited to wear glasses at all. So I'm so happy to put y'all on to Sojo's and if you guys use my code, you guys will be able to get 15% off. First of all, the glasses came in a super cute box and it had a mirror. I can definitely store glasses in there if I buy more from the website I definitely will store them in this box these are the first glasses I would really wear these as like an everyday wear I think they are super cute and I really just like these styles because these styles are different than glasses that I've had in the past I usually get more thinner frames so this is the first pair and these are the ones that I'm actually wearing in the video today they are actually my favorite these are probably not more everyday wear for certain people but for me I would wear these every day they're super cute and yes they are big but they're different than the ones that I've had in the past so these are definitely my favorite these are clear frames and i've never had clear frames ever so this is my first time and these are actually everybody's favorite ones on me i think these are also more like everyday wear but i think they are so cute these are less of an everyday wear to me they're more stylish i definitely could see me wearing these with like an outfit like i would definitely style these they're definitely more stylish they're clear but they're like teal too but these are definitely cute and unique and different so i love that and the next two they picked out and they sent me these and they're definitely more on the extra side but we can get into the details but yeah so now that i put y'all on y'all can check out the glasses that i'm wearing and more styles in the description box down below and don't forget to use my code for 50 percent off i definitely love these and i definitely was so excited for them to come in the mail and they came super fast so if y'all want to go get some y'all can get some i'm putting you on now so when y'all see my glasses don't be like girl where you got them from i'm telling you right now girl but without further ado let's get back to regularly scheduled programming Good morning y'all it is currently 8 30 i just finished brushing my teeth and eating a bowl of cereal i'm in my bed or whatever but i've been trying to wake up around eight o'clock when i do that i get so much done before 12 and i'm really noticing that about myself i wanted to bring you guys along on my morning routine here is my to-do list for today i've been trying to put more routine implicated into my life because i'm really in control of how my day starts and how my day goes so i've been trying to use my time wisely and to do that like i really need some structure Child, she wanna make an appearance. Girl, why you hiding? I thought she wanted to talk. What's tea? I don't know why she yawning like she just had a long night, girl. All you do is sleep and eat. Good morning. Good morning. <coughs> but yeah, I've been trying to implicate more structure into the new year because I definitely need more organization when it comes to my life. But as I'm growing and I am full on independent, I realized that there's different things that make me happy that probably like I don't even make me happy. Going to the gym actually makes me happy. It's honestly a mental thing for me because it gives me something to do when I wake up. Just for my own mental, it just makes me feel better that I'm just doing something productive. That makes me happy. And then also I try to like do something new all the time. So today I'm going to be trying Cardi B's hair mask because I feel like I definitely could be taking way better care of my hair. Like I feel like everybody always asks me like how does my hair grow so long after I cut it over and over again and honestly it's because I just don't care about it. Like I literally let my hair do whatever it wants but since I've been letting my hair grow I need to be taking care of it. Like girl you cannot be walking around with long hair that's not giving what it's supposed to be. <laughs> so I want to try doing a hair mask. I just be trying to like try new things. Try to do like an art project or just try to do something that just you know makes me happy and new stuff makes me happy all the time so that's what i'm gonna be doing today also disclaimer being that girl is like a mental thing also like whether i were to wake up at eight in the morning or whether i were to wake up at six in the morning or whether i were to wake up at two o'clock p.m i will wake up and still have a good day and still be that girl i've seen people wake up at like five in the morning and go to the gym and i commend them for that but am i doing that no and am i still that girl of course you know what i'm saying <laughs> and even if i decided to not go to the gym and i decided that i want to have a crab boil and i want to lay in bed and have a day for myself am i still that girl yes so that's just a disclaimer so i feel like a lot of this stuff is like really trendy right now and everybody's like trying to fit the trendy stuff into their life and it doesn't work because it's not what you want to be doing it's not genuine to you so do what you want to do and if you're happy doing it then you're that girl or that boy and that's just point blank you know what i'm saying but enough talking also my nail broke because i was helping my mom move ignore that i'm getting my nails done this week so it's okay 
Let's get ready to go to the gym. All right, y'all, so I am gym ready. I'm about to go inside and get a good workout in. Um, Snow is with me because she be having separation anxiety and I'm only in the gym for like 45 minutes. I just leave the car on for her and she's fine. She's more than fine. So I'm about to go inside and I'm gonna get a good workout in. Put my AirPods in. Fun fact, when I was in school, I always used to have AirPods in or headphones regardless. Even if I wasn't listening to music, that way people could just not talk to me. I would literally walk around school with headphones on with no music, playing inside the headphone just so people don't talk to me. But yeah, enough talking. Let's get this workout in. You focus on millions and everything. I just took me to trip out the Africa. See how we came from the mud and the bottom. Hey, hey. Oh, I see how they counted this. I bet they never gonna do it again. You see why they think it's me. Hey, they know I'm going hey, right in. Hey. Oh, I was trying to get this money in this life is sad. I pulled up before they got my dog on murder hey, again. Hey. Oh, see the fuck I'm out the head. to get in the shower so I can make me some coffee so I can really start my day. Uh, your girl is at the shower and I'm ready to eat something and read but I'm wearing my Nicole Allure merch. I think she's restocking very soon so make sure y'all go shop and support and I think her new launch is coming up soon too so go support my girl. But I am ready to eat something and drink some coffee and I'm also ready to be outside and be in the air because the rest of the day I'm usually if I don't have any errands to run I usually just stay inside and edit or just be home because it's very comfy so when I can just go outside and breathe some air even if it's cold air because right now it's a little bit chilly i'm gonna do that but yeah let's make this coffee so i'm gonna make my coffee um over here i have my little coffee station so i actually don't need these filters because i have one already but the coffee that i use is the great value french vanilla from walmart and i love french vanilla because i love sweet stuff but you guys will see why in a minute and then i also have this torani white chocolate sauce hey y'all when i tell you this is so good they have the chocolate and the caramel but i was like oh my god i never had white chocolate sauce in my coffee so i had to grab it yeah that's my little coffee station over here let me turn this light on so y'all can see my coffee maker oh also i have this rug in my kitchen i don't think i ever showed y'all that so my coffee maker is over here with my appliances my other appliances are in the cabinet but i just have my air fryer and my coffee maker out you guys actually were the ones who recommended me the mr coffee ice coffee maker because y'all told me since i like cold coffee i should get this one and yes the ice melts because it is hot coffee going inside of it but i don't know why i don't know what's the science behind this coffee machine 
but the ice melts, but the drink is not watery. Like, I swear, I'm not lying. And also, I've been using this creamer since I got the machine. It is the Coffee Make Rice Krispie Trees. I love Rice Krispie Trees. Like, I literally have them in my pantry as we speak. I love a good Rice Krispie Treat. So, that's why when I seen this, I was like, ooh, I gotta have it. I gotta have it. Oh, and look at my little stink stink. Ciao, boom. That picture is actually supposed to go on a frame in my entryway, but I just haven't got the frame for it yet because I'm not sure what size the picture is. But, yeah, let's make this coffee. <laughs> coffee is made i guess i added whipped cream because y'all know i dunk in some time they don't be giving me it but you know what? when i'm at home bro i don't need your whipped cream i got my own whipped cream babe we're about to go to this area near me and i love going there because it is so nice so beautiful and i could just sit down and read and i haven't been able to go because it's been raining so y'all actually caught me on a good morning but the book that i'm reading is the subtle art of not giving a fuck it is a great book like i pick this book up whenever i am not doing anything or i just take sessions and read it at the park it is really good and it's funny and it talks about real stuff like the real so if you guys want to pick up a good read you guys can do that before i go do that i'm gonna get something to eat i guess y'all can say i have two breakfasts i guess if you want to say because i did have like cereal before in the morning but that's like a pre-snack for me honestly because i don't even be eating all my cereal bowls anymore because i literally used to eat cereal every day at one point in my life so and of course no is going <sighs> i just have um these skin bottoms on come on all right, y'all, so I am in the car, and I decided what I wanted to eat. I'm going to go to Taco Bell and get a Power Bowl, but I had Chipotle the other day, and it was delicious, but I just don't feel like eating Chipotle again. That's why I'm going to Taco Bell. Also, I do not feel like going inside and ordering anything because it's cold, and I'm already going to be sitting outside. I just don't feel like going inside nowhere and then having to come back in the car. And the reason why I haven't done my hair yet is because it's only 940, so it's about to be 10. So I haven't really, like, got ready for the day day yet because I'm about to do the mask when I come back and then we're gonna get ready for the day. So this is not me actually ready for the day, okay? This is still pre-everything. Okay, girl, I just threw on lashes because I wanted to throw on lashes. But I think today is gonna be a good day because I said stuff. Oh, I also didn't show you guys my whole workout routine because my camera died. Also, I'm not no personal trainer or nothing like that to even show you what to do anyway. But I've just been doing the 12.33. I put the treadmill on an incline of 12 and then I walk for 30 minutes and the speed is three. And then I also do 50 squats, 50 crunches, and then I hop on the elliptical afterwards for like 10 minutes. So my workout routine is really fast and really quick. And that's really it. Is my clicking sound annoying? I'm so sorry if it's bothering you, but listen. The last thing I need in my life is to get pulled over by me and cop because baby, that insurance. <laughs> that insurance ain't no joke. Did you finna go? Did you just honk your horn at me? You see, that's what I'm talking about. The light just turned green. Don't put me honking your horn at me because I just said I don't need no tickets and I definitely don't need to be arrested for dragging you out your car. I think I like this song so much because he sampled my song. Is the line long? Oh no, it's not long. Where's my purse? Girl, y'all know I lost my last purse. The whole purse with everything in it. So I really thought for a second that I did that again. I would have been pissed. Girl, I took off my seatbelt. <laughs> Girl, I was about to hop in this drive through and I said, where's my purse? Honey, where's my super suit? Nah, honey, where my purse at? Losing my entire purse. Like, I'm such a dummy for that. Like, who does that? They don't know, Belle. Hi, can I have a Power Bowl? Okay, chicken? Yes. Anything else? That'll be all. Good. 
Can I have a mild sauce? Thank you. Have a great day. Thank you, too. Oh, she was nice. Got my food, but I will see you guys when I am entering the park. So this is my veggie ball. God, it is so freezing. Cardi B hair mask. Um, I don't have a big blender. Like, I don't even think this is considered a blender at all. But we're about to do this hair mask. So the actual ingredients for it that I saw were banana, avocado, argan oil, olive oil, black castor oil, avocado oil, raw honey, mayonnaise, egg. Okay. So I have the honey and I have the avocado oil. I also have I also have the castor oil, the avocado, the egg, and the mayonnaise. I probably said that so wrong, but um. When I looked up the ingredients, I didn't see any measurements, so we're about to do this my way, which is very freelance. So I have my avocado here. I cut it. It's an avocado. Thanks. Oh my god, this is so slimy. <laughs> no. Apparently, the argan oil is what makes this not smell so bad, but I don't have argan oil. Mayonnaise. I'm gonna crack the egg in there first. It probably would be best to have measurements, but I don't have any. I'm just not gonna put too much of anything, honestly, because I can't really tell you if I'm excited for this or not, because um, I'm just so used to not taking care of my hair, so used to not doing hair mask. Ugh. The mayonnaise part is killing me right now, like why? All right, I have 100% raw honey. The honey is very good. And I just got mayonnaise on this. Y'all can't even see that I'm pouring into here. Avocado way worse like i'm thinking i was gonna smell it and i was about to start gagging but honestly it just doesn't smell bad but i definitely think that after i do this my next wash is gonna be really good because i got some new hair products and they work really well and they smell so good so i think after i put this mask on oh my god i didn't even see how long i'm supposed to put it on for i honestly think that um this is gonna be good for my hair Well, I hope. A girl can only hope. Like 
I said, I'm really not sure how long I'm supposed to put it on for because instructions were unclear. I mean, I probably could like dive deep and search for, but I'm not worried about it that much, honestly. I don't even know how long I'm gonna keep it in for. That's how you know I'm not worried about it. <sighs> and I'm not very sure about how I'm gonna put this on either. Instructions were very unclear, but I got them from a TikTok comment section, so I'm not. Okay. This is actually not bad. bananas in my kitchen and I totally forgot to add the bananas in the mixture so next time I do this for sure I definitely will add the banana in here and I definitely will do this again because it actually does not smell that bad as much as I thought it was gonna be and it was very easy to do I didn't make a mess at all so I'm about to just put my timer on for 30 minutes and then wash my hair and then I'm actually gonna get ready for the day All right, guys, so now I'm about to actually get ready for my day. I washed the Cardi B hair mask on my hair, as you can see. My hair definitely feels soft. I think it's because the olive oil, but it definitely feels soft, and it looks really shiny. But I'm about to get ready for my day. I don't really have to do much because I already have lashes on, and I also have gloves on already. Also, it is mad cold outside, so... But sometimes in Florida, like, in the morning, it is really cold. So I think during the rest of the day, I think it will get warmer. But I don't want to actually, like, step outside again until it actually gets a little bit warmer and the sun is, like, beaming, so it's hotter. I'm just going to put some moisture are on all right now let's get into this hair care a lot of y'all been asking me for like a color hair routine and i guess you can call this that too i mean y'all are getting a lot wow a lot of stuff in one morning wow i usually don't have to wash my hair and style it in the morning because my hair is usually already done and i just leave it curly and big and i just go about my day so like, really i would be done about now but since i did the mask i have to wash the stuff off and add my products in here so this is the new products that I picked up. First of all, I want to say this, and this is not sponsored, by the way. This is the best smelling hair product I've ever smelled in my life, y'all. Like, this smells fantastic. I asked somebody what it smelled like, and they said it's like they could eat it. Like, that's how good it smells. Like, it smells so good. Like, if this wasn't a lotion for my body, I would definitely use it. It's the Camille Rose Curl Love Moisture Milk, Rice Milk, and Macadamia Oil. A softening leave-in conditioning cream with light notes of macadamia nut and vanilla. And I love of both of those and this is also a leave-in conditioner i guess it is the miss jesse's leave-in condition and it's also leave-in conditioner but it looks more like a jam texture i put it on like to scrunch my curls after i style it with the other stuff but we're gonna get into this hair look how shiny the mask made my hair it's very shiny and very soft what i do is basically apply this to the sections and then when i'm done i flip my head down and then i scrunch my curls with this and then dry my hair with a t-shirt but i'm about to get started and start applying this stuff a few bottles on the table a few waters
y'all so that is it that is my hair routine that is what i do every time that i wash my hair don't wash my hair a lot unless i really have to because i like to leave it alone leave it alone is the best way that your hair grows and i'm trying to get my hair to keep growing as it's good. and yeah i'm about to put some clothes on and i think i'm about to get a car wash and then continue the rest of my day thank you guys so much for watching this video i love you all so much make sure y'all follow my instagram at my to see more of me and thank you guys for starting my day with me i appreciate you all so much and i will see you guys in my next video bye y'all